Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. Today we are making another meal prep recipe, my version of a grilled asada style steak. This recipe is going to have macros of 299 calories, 14.8 grams of fat, 1.1 grams of carbohydrates, and a whopping 40.6 grams of protein with a total of eight servings in all. Let's get going and start cooking. To get things going, let's first start off with our marinade, which is gonna call for a half tablespoon of ground black pepper, one tablespoon of dried cilantro leaves, one teaspoon of sea salt. I'm using Morton sea salt here, but you can use any kind of salt you want. Half a tablespoon of paprika or smoked paprika. Half a tablespoon of hot Mexican style chili powder one half tablespoon of ground cumin, one half tablespoon of garlic powder, and last but not least, we're gonna add one cup of organic apple cider vinegar. Once all our ingredients are combined into a bowl, go ahead and give it a good whisk to make sure that all the ingredients are mixed together evenly. The cut of beef I'm using here is called a beef loin flap meat steak. I'm using 3.7 pounds of it, which I found at the local grocery store. I'm gonna pour three tablespoons of olive oil over it and making sure to coat all the outside of the steak before I pour the marinade on top. Once you pour the marinade on top of your steak, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and coat every single piece of meat so that everything is properly seasoned evenly. I have a tendency to roll the steak when I'm done, when I let it sit. I'm gonna allow this to marinate for about an hour in the fridge, and then I'm gonna take it out and allow it to sit and get up to room temperature for about 20 minutes before I put it on the grill. Here's a quick tip to clean your grill before you start cooking. Cut an onion in half and scrub the grill before you fire it on, making sure that the juice covers every bit of the grill. It will make scrubbing and getting the dirt off much easier. Once you've covered the grill with all the onion juice, fire up the grill to high temperature, cover it for about 10 minutes and allow it to preheat. Scrub it before you put on the meat and you should have a very clean grill to start with. We're gonna keep our temperature on high here as we slap the steak down. The cook time is going to be six minutes total, about three minutes per side, flipping halfway through. Before you pull your steak off, make sure you line a large Tupperware with some foil. What we're gonna do is pull the steak off, put it in this foil and cover it for about 20 minutes. It's gonna allow the steak to cook a little bit longer, make it very tender and hold all those juices and all those flavors in there. Once the 20 minutes are up, you can go ahead and cut into your steak and begin portioning it out. As you can see right here, I have portioned mine out already into vacuum sealed bags, which I will freeze. Every single meal I am serving with a basmati rice. Four are gonna have green beans and four are gonna have a red bell pepper, red onion, and mushroom medley with them. This is a very versatile steak recipe, so you can actually serve this with sweet potatoes, white potatoes, or on tacos. That'll do it for this recipe. If you found this useful or enjoyable, please drop a like, hit subscribe if you're brand new, and as always, eat healthy, stay happy. I'll see you guys next time.